Friday, October 8th, uh, 2010, um, 5.59, 6 o'clock p.m. Uh, what is it? I just got home from work and um, I actually, I swear to God, what is it? Um, last week when they gave me my schedule, I was asked to work, um, what is it, 12 to like 5 or 5.30. But um, while I was there, what is it, apparently, well, according to um, the manager on duty, I was supposed to be off at 4.30 and, you know, when I noticed this, it was already like, you know, like 4.40 or something. But yeah, um, what is it? Um, I actually... Before I begin, let me just say that um, I actually very much like where I work and I actually very much like the people I work with and there's actually only um, six employees at our store in total and um, yeah, I like everyone and um, this is not intending to badmouth everyone but you know, um, I think today it seemed like a lot of people, well maybe not a lot but um, let's see, I saw um, at least four different employees including myself today and um, what is it? Or including myself. Wait, no way in hell we have only six. Well, I was told we only had six in total, but obviously that's not true. Anyways, um, what is it? So I saw, you know, at least four other employees today, and it just seemed like, um, our two managers anyways, they seem, uh, really stressed out. Yeah, and, um, you know, you can't fault them, and, you know, I think their fuses were a little shorter today. And what is it? And that's okay, because I know I have days where, you know, I'm extremely impatient too, and, you know, yeah, but I just felt really bad today just because um, I felt like I was making more errors than usual and, you know, normally I think I'm very careful about things like that and I hope that, you know, they don't think poorly of me now, but I think I might have, you know, been at this place long enough where they know that I'm not usually so, you know, airheaded, but then again, who knows, yeah, and, you know, I, I just feel like, um, <laughs> I, I know it sounds kind of stupid, but it almost feels like, you know, the the, what is it, the mood's almost a little contagious, and like, you know, it's like, you know, what do I even have to be upset about, but, you know, I guess it's just because, you know, I'm messing up, and, you know, they're stressed out, and I'm a little stressed out, but, you know, obviously, you know, like, no one's, like, lashing on each other, I think that's what's important, but, yeah, so, you know, today was just a little, hmm, yeah, but I would totally swore I worked until at least five, but, you know, guess not, but that's okay, but then again, I thought I'd get at least five hours or five and a half hours, because I got a lunch today. Whatever. Yeah, that's not important. But anyway, yeah. Uh, oh, yes, let me talk about my map a little bit. Uh -huh. Yeah. Actually, um, this shirt, it's by the brand um, Iron Fist. It's actually um, one of my favorite brands, sort of. I got it from the store I work at. And um, it's, you know, a cameo with, um, what is it, skeleton rib and then butterflies because I have butterflies in my stomach. Yeah, but I also have Chipotle, so those butterflies get to sit in there with all the, you know, wonderful nasty kind of things I put in my burrito. Yeah. Oh man. What else? Um, let's see. Um, I feel like lately uh, I wanted to, you know, I always say I want to pick up drawing again because I haven't been drawing any like completed pieces. But um, one, one day, uh, actually I think it was like last week on Wednesday or something. I remember it was Wednesday because I was waiting for computer applications for fashion. Um, what is it? I just started drawing in my uh, sketchbook because, you know, at first I was like, I'm gonna try to draw that tree over there, and then it turned into this whole scene, and then what is it? Yeah, I think um, the preliminary sketch was actually a lot nicer than um, how I'm trying to complete it. Yeah, sketchier things actually kind of have a nice feeling sometimes, and sometimes I think they're usually better than my other works. But yeah. So here's the preliminary, so this is technically the nicer one. I don't know if you guys can really see that. Mm -hmm. And then, um, so I was like, okay, well, this is really nice, and, you know, I've never really prided myself as someone who's very good at, like, um, landscapes or, like, scenery, but I thought that wasn't bad for, like, you know, kind of a first try kind of thing. So I was like, okay, well, maybe we could take it up another step and do it bigger, since that one was just in pen. I was like, you know, I have all sorts of, like, you know, art materials I don't use, and, you know, I don't want them to go to waste, so I decided that I would, like, you know, pull out the, the nibs and, you know, the ink. And you know, go go play a little. And what is it? And um, I tried to recreate it, but I don't think it came out too well. And obviously, I'm not done. And I think I might have watered down the ink too much, so it's really, really light. Yeah. But anyway, so that's what I've been up to. But I only did this in like you know less than an hour or something last night. But it's not as nice as I had hoped. And also, was I think I spaced things out um, awkwardly. But yeah. What else? What else? Um. 
for whatever reason lately um, I have been very much anticipating another tattoo like I'm totally itching to have another one I don't know why because you know for a while I went through that period of time where I'm just like I'm mentally addicted to tattoos and then you know after I got like you know what I already have I'm just like okay we can calm down now because you know you got your fix but um what is it I think I got these I got them in either March or April I, I don't even remember I'm gonna say April because that just sounds more correct whenever Easter was because I actually got it on Easter Sunday but yeah so you know I got those and now I'm totally itching to have another one and I'm trying to um contemplate I don't know if I um if I wanted um, my lotus flower like just a lotus flower by itself or like in some kind of you know circle or something because I sketched it out and like I was like oh that doesn't look bad by you know like that but then I was like I don't know is it too enclosed if it's in a circle or does it look funny if it's just floating by itself without the circle so now I'm just all sorts of indecisive and ugh, I swear to god I would, I would already have had this tattoo in November last year if I had the artwork for the lotus flower that's what actually what I intended um, to what is it get as my first one but obviously that didn't happen I got this one as my first one then I got my goldfish and then my flower and oh my damn lotus yeah but anyways um, I gotta make this quick because um, my sister called me and we're supposed to go jogging anyway yeah so um, other news I got my blonde patch back I'm too lazy to get red because then I have to maintain it and then um, what else? What else? What else? What else? I think that's almost kind of pretty much it ish. It ish. Is that a word? It ish. Yeah. Okay, well, um, I guess that for now concludes the October, October 8th, uh, 2010 video blog. Thank you for watching.